quote, queen. Any misquote, <laughs> information, quote, queen. Any misquote, <laughs> and you keep misquoting for years. Free my nigga. Uh -uh. You're not misquoting. You are intentionally. Let's see. Uh, let's see all messages. All right, let's see all messages. Um, let me get my COVID started, you all. Can y'all hear Queen? Y'all know I go up and down in my voice, and I want to walk away to my coffee. Can you hear me? Testing, testing. One, two, two. and three. Can you hear me? I can't even get no audio help from these folks. Jesus in the bushes. A one, can you hear me? You over here? Get on my nerves. Nobody's in your chat. That's no. That's why nobody's talking, because nobody's in your chat. Because your channel is... Dead, 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 dead. You suck, nigga! So I tell you the truth, these folks can't even help me with my audio check. Get on my nerves, what you over here for? Because nobody's there. Uh, nope. the, I guess y'all can hear me. Nobody's in your chat. Shit. Look, 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 it's over here. All nobody, right. it's, it's empty. How you expect mm -hmm. nobody to type when nobody's there? Right. It's, look, it's empty. Oh, sweet Jesus. How you doing? Oh, right. Thank you. Dead, dead, dead. 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 Ain't gonna worry about no audio issue, Jesus. All right, yeah, woke up. Woke up this morning. Your chat is dead, 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 dead. When you wake up in the morning, when you get my age, you get you a cup of coffee, and as you making that coffee, you get glory, glory, for so being on top of the ground. Yes, I am. On top of the ground. Y'all get up with all this uh, negative energy. Drops. I right, get up thinking. Bruh, waking me up on time. Oh my Jesus. She she literally just having a conversation out loud by herself. She she literally just having a conversation. We got one person. One hour later. She literally just having a just a out <laughs> just an outspoken conversation to herself. Just talking out loud, literally. Ain't nobody in there for you to talk to. I don't ask for a hundred. I don't ask for a hundred. Live to a hundred in my right mind and with money, okay? I am very specific about my prayers. I want to live to the hundred in my right mind. Hopefully not. And what was the other thing? See, I forgot. <laughs> and with money. And my Draco. See, I'm a simple woman. I ain't that deep. I pray that specifically for the things I want along my pursuit of happiness. Yes, yes, yes. You gotta ask for what you want. And you gotta be very specific. Don't be scared. Ask for what you deserve. You know what you deserve. And whoever you begging to know what you deserve, I'm not begging nothing. I just say I'm here. Next month. But you told me the problem is the dog full of trouble. So I'm here to collect on that dog full of trouble. Because God knows I had troubles. God knows I had troubles. Good morning. How are you? Let's see here. You can thank you so much. Thank you very well. Uh, where are they? Chico, how you doing, Chico? Hopefully you get some with Queen. Nice to meet you. Thanks for stopping by my channel. I am a uh, house in Atlanta, Georgia. I am 58 years old, retired nurse, politician. Mm -hmm. She's going down her resume with one person in the chat, Tickle. She's going down her resume because one person typed in the chat, so she's about to go through her whole resume with one person in the chat. Hey, my name is Queen Regina. And I'm a politician. I'm a nurse. I'm a registered. There's just only one person in your chat, dummy. Jesus, holy moly. Military vet. And I'm here to share my stories. Share my stories with folks who pass through uh, on the way visiting other channels on YouTube. I am a Southern Belle. I am eccentric, one of a kind. Show. She really good. <laughs> One person in the chat. One person. Hi, how you doing? I'm glad you're here. I'm Queen Regina. 58 years old. I live in Georgia. Homegrown Georgia, that is. I love I love it here. She, she really It's one lady. It's just one person. Nigga, get your stupid ass off the internet! Making a motherfucking fool out of yourself! Fuck! Nigga! Okay, I am an introvert now. But most people don't believe that I'm an introvert. Because uh, when I do come to the stage, Big Mama, when I come to the stage and get on the mic, and I really don't need no mic, I'm gonna bring the house down. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna bring the house down. Oh, that's when you 
broke and you all you got is about two, three thousand cousins. We put on uh we put on uh, a variety show. Mm-hmm. And your cousins, aunties, they vote on you. And these people, hey, you know what they the same man, where y'all think the same man come from? Shit, black folks will have you crying off the stage, okay? Get your sorry, you know off. You ain't funny. Look at who look at your teeth. Ah, I tell you. I tell you. <laughs> if you Yo, she is entertaining herself like she's having a great time by herself. She cracking up. She telling herself a joke. She laughing at her joke. She answering her own questions. She's clapping for herself. You gummy dummy. I mean, she having a good old time by herself. Stay on your family stage. You can. No, you ready for the big stage? You ready for the big stage? I'm ready. I've been ready all my life. I had to, you know, cut a rug, so to speak, with my cousins mm-hmm. and an introvert, and they bullies. Okay, so I never said much. They didn't even know I was as talented. And they said, "Yeah, my whole family is talented." At the bar, until you know they would have to do something really, 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 really bad to get me to speak or talk. And I'm not a person for conflict. I used to wish it go away, and now queen. Take action. Not on my motherfucking watch. I don't know how I just, I just, I just got good timing. I don't know how I do it. It, I, it just like, it just don't, it just don't fail. It just, it just don't fail. I don't know how, but I just, I just seem to have really good timing. Not on my motherfucking watch. I'm gonna take action. That's all. Y'all woke up with sleeping big mama. That's all. But I've been, I ain't been sleeping. I've been this way. I've been woke before y'all even got that terminology. Woke. Yeah. You white folks, that's your y'all white queen. Uh, you say I tell you, you know, terrorize them, shit them. You just got me wrong. That is y'all. Just because you look like me, I ain't cutting you no slack. I don't like disrespectful folks, period. Especially if I'm leading with uh, respect and I'm not bothering you. I'm not gonna stop giving my opinion. You can phone. Take them out, have seizures, all you want, I'm going to say what I got to say. In our America, the one that I went to the military, you know they have five dogs. Mm-hmm. So. Good morning, Danger Boys. I miss you. I'll be back over there to visit with you. Good morning. Good morning. Who are you talking to? You just made up a name? Did, did, did you just literally make, make up somebody's name? There's only one person that was typing in your chat. How you doing, Philip? Yeah, good morning. I'll be over there after I read my read the newspaper. All right, yeah, I'll be over there at the church. There's nobody typing. Who are you talking to? Mm, maybe I got the wrong person. though. let me see. Try these glasses. Mm-mm. You got to kick out. This ain't no data boys. It's somebody else. But you know, early in the morning. Don't bother me. I don't know about me. Who you I don't know you You just mm-hmm. making up shit. So a good thing to do with your morning coffee is your morning tea there. or your morning water. This is a prune, okay? And I, I don't know how you all feel about prunes when I eat this for a function, okay? Yes, I like to eat for, you know, the food tastes good or whatever, or, you know, there's vitamins, it's, you know, but food has a purpose. And this one here for me, my purpose is not all food, no. You know, for the most part, it, it, it'll act. So it's supposed to be acting every gut, the stomach. It's gonna move years. Oh, and years of waste. No. Okay? The daily, uh, the day. I'm flagging this shit. This is this got to be inappropriate. Talking about this, this is child abuse promoting terrorism. This got to be against you two guidelines. She talking about shitting and shit. Yeah, hateful speech, something. But yeah, bully, harass. It's something. I'm, I'm gonna figure it. Out. I'm gonna flag your ass. Well, keep the shit away. Okay, the shit out of your gut. It will clean you. Just a little prune. No, no pills. No uh, taking no uh, Epsom salt. I'm not wearing no y'all be wrong. Exactly, Candyman. Clearly, she like eating. Personality, based on your electrolyte, pH balance, your mood. I don't want to be around you. Why you starving yourself to death? Uh, I don't even know. You don't even like you. I ain't starving myself for nobody. Mm -hmm. Oh Lord. (laughs) Especially not no man dropping no ocean with a hat on. Mm-hmm. You can't tell me shit. 
Let people in there, people. It's free, yeah. man. It's this guy who's stalking me. He's been stalking me. He turned 40 in July. 40 years old. Mm -hmm. And he covered up a smile uh, until he was 38. So he just turned 40 this year. Covered up a smile for 38 years. And, you know, there's repercussions. So, you know, you organically, you want to laugh. You heard something funny. You want to laugh. <laughs> you don't want to do this, you know? <laughs> but when you are so, you know, you know how you look. Yeah. You know, a space between every tooth. Mm -hmm. And they, they were angled and jagged, you know? They didn't even look like teeth. That they really didn't. was. They really? Didn't. Yeah, a little, a little crooked. A little sitting sideways, boys in the days. A, a little... A little jagged, you said, huh? It, it was a little crooked. It was, it was like one tooth leaning to the side and the other one, you know, doing the crip walk. The other one doing the Harlem shake. The other one doing the vacay bounce. You know, just a little crooked, little, little jagged, you say. What? And they had an overbite. Oh, an overbite, huh? A list. Everything that could go wrong went wrong with his mouth. You know, the palate wasn't fully developed, so it lists. Okay. Oh, lisp. So, like, when you say S words, you you sound like you're spitting. Oh, okay. Projection, projection, projection. <laughs> Yo, projection is a real thing on these YouTube streets, man. But it wants to critique orators like myself. Yeah. I don't have a lisp. All right, I'm over bad. My palate, palate is the top, the roof, you know, the mouth, your, your taste buds, all of this beautiful, inside beautiful. structure, foundation mm -hmm. to help the mouth be a mouth. Okay, yeah, it's not just teeth. Yeah, it's the top of your roof of your mouth, bottom yeah. of your mouth, uh, your overbite, all these things, all these things. Eat all of them fucked up on him. Okay, uh, so the fix wasn't easy, and the, you know the investment, yeah. you know, just wasn't worth it because even if you got. Hey Russell, Eric hey, where you been, man? Super shattered five dollars. I knew Grimace from McDonald's was black. A butterfly <laughs> in its cocoon stage. Salute to you, Russell Red. Super shattered five dollars. This is funny but sad at the same time women pay attention. This is a strong independent woman who is lonely. Her money gone and her young boy heart is gone. Listen, man, this is a strong black woman right here. All right. So this is a teachable moment. Appreciate you, Russell Red. Hey, Russell. Hey, I just I just answered your question a while ago. You was like, hey, what that, you know, mouth do pause. No diddy. When you was talking about Regina, man, you might want to flip it back a few minutes. You can see what that mouth do. All right, just, just just go back a few minutes. It's a nice still image. I think you might like that. Mm -hmm. Appreciate you, Russell. Appreciate you, Derek. Salute. Let's get it. What big eyes? What big eyes? He has. Uh, oh, what? I mean, no hair in his thirties. So we can't fuck it. When you get grounded on your own, get you some new teeth. Okay, that's that's the deal. I don't got you through uh, three. Uh, set a cot, get your ass out of here, and get your new teeth when you can. You're on your own way. Especially after you uh, poison yourself in school, okay? We did the best we could since you off. And you go there trying to make folks laugh. Try to make folks look at me, look at me. Well, we saw you in the hospital and I see you and on the side floor when they 5150 your ass for poisoning yourself. Okay? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No one poisoned you with alcohol. Damn, free me. <laughs> this is a teaching, critiquing message, you two, for young folks who are alcoholics and should probably seek help. When you can poison yourself, Mm -hmm. You have to be contained and, and secluded and watch the cameras, okay? Because see, I take a drink, I stop in the movies, I don't have too much, I had too much, I stop, okay? Damn. And if I don't stop and I, you know, stumble a little bit, don't want it to step. It's time to stop. I'm gonna recognize these signs. Right. So I'm not gonna make a pass and I'm home. Mm -hmm. I'll um, speech off in a little stumble. That's that's mm -mm. It's time to go to bed, Queen, mm -hmm. okay? And I am Queen Regina on this channel, but again, I have two other channels, Checkmates, the motherfucking awesome show, girl. So I will banter about uh, one moment I'm Queen, one moment I'm Checkmates. But I'm always, I'm always. The motherfucking awesome show, girl. She make all those faces.
<laughs> Bless me. The motherfucking So my darling, get well soon. Yo, hey, seriously, that low key kind of scared me. I ain't gonna cap that. Hey, who jumped? I ain't gonna. Hey, that 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 low key kind of scared me. I ain't think. <laughs> who jumped in the chat, man? That shit was low key kind of scary. I ain't gonna cap to you. You were putting on a show in there for the people in the hospital. They, you don't make they eight hours or twelve hours. Child, you in there got the people busting. They stomach wide laughing. I know, I know that, honey. They go, you know, you're gonna be the kind of patient when you know you don't got them well and supported them through the uh, episode. Lady, who are you talking? And then they go home. The dynamics of the floor, the building changes when you go home because you know all our patients are not as funny as you. It, you know, entertain the staff. She's talking. You're giving them people the joy and the laughter some have had, haven't had in maybe years. Mm. So I'm happy to assist you. The OG historian, OG. Yeah, she was before me and a whole lot of others. So you know I respect you. Now? I don't know. But I mean, I do got a little sliver, slice of his mind. The post life historian. Oh, and there's something people just don't remember correctly. And I don't know why they continue to do this. These people are uh, younger than Queen. And I, oh, I'm on the record with memory issues, okay? Yes, we know. But something about a lie would trigger my motherfucking memory. Especially if you're lying on Queen, okay? Especially if you're lying on Queen. What? That's that one? Y'all, y'all know it. Just like when ears, ears in the way, uh, he told me, the man was over there saying, uh, uh, you had Queen up here shouting these things out on your stage. And I said, oh, wait a minute, oh, wait a minute, on your stage. Huh? Tell me that again. Is <laughs> and he, uh, the one that jumps in the ocean with a head on. No, there was no crash out. Queen lit this bitch up. Y'all just got to see it for the first time. Some of y'all. That's how I would do him. I'll fly behind the scenes. Okay. And anybody else that fuck with me. You know what? I said, uh, Queen, did you hear him? Uh, with the stick talk, stick talk. And then he brought you up and said, uh, I allowed you on my platform to, to say these things over and over again about stick talk. I said, well, me, here, come on, you know. Now let me see the evidence, because you know Queen got to see the evidence, because you know, you know, I trust Ears, God knows I do. So I had to, and this audience, I respect this audience, because I got there late that day. And they had already uh, been bombarded by his stick talk. And it's just exhausting. God knows it's exhausting. It's quirky. It's off putting. It's from nowhere. It's, I don't know what it is. I don't. Yeah, and so KB. he said, Yeah, Queen is here. And he brought your name up. Who brought my name up? Said, Hold on. Show the old mother looking stuff with that. Me? Uh, what? What do you think? Yeah, if y'all could have seen me, y'all heard me. But this is what I, you look at me. This is how I look. Oh, I'm on my goddamn cell phone. And I'm up here. I got, you know, I already got my little uh, ipples in or whatever. I'm making a gesture. You know what? Yo, I really wish we could have seen her in action. Oh, I would have loved to see that. That moment when she was spazzing out on the uh, ears platform. Oh, I, I wish she cammed up. Oh, I sure wish she did. I would have loved to see it. What else? You was there. No, you wasn't there, Ills. Hey, Shay, how you doing? Oh, he said you was there. You sure? Ills, oh, you lying to Queen. Ills say he wasn't lying to me. And I mean, Ills, you know, he ain't never ambushed me like that. Now, nah. Ills don't do a lot of things to Queen. Queen, what's about things to Ills? Ills is a good sport. He ain't gonna go and hijack and ambush me on other people's panels. He's on his own panel, talking shit to Queen. Don't do this to these people uh, 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 playing programs, bringing Queen up. Because then I, I do have a whole, uh, I'm telling you, a bad personality. My kids have always said, Daddy, at the parties, they on parties. I don't cook the college greens, the folks, oh my God. Oh, your mom, your mom, your mom, your mom. Oh, these accolades. So, oh my God, this food. Oh my God, she is so, and she is so adorable. Oh, she is so funny. And my kids be really like, y'all don't know that lady. Yo, what is she talking? I'm lost. She 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 was at a party. She was at tears. She was on the panel. Now she making muffins. Now she changing tires. Now she checked the mailbox. She drinking coffee. She went to sleep. Woke up. Filed taxes. I'm I'm confused. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I know that. Oh. <laughs> 
Queen, now she's like, that's how y'all know that ain't Queen crazy. Queen talk to me. No, don't tell no half a lot on Queen, because you cuss too, okay? And we've all seen it. And I you know I know you cuss. I ain't getting up here trying to be a fucking saint. Not on my motherfucking watch, not on my motherfucking name, okay? Good morning, good morning. Look, ladies, good morning, my darling. Happy Tuesday. You know, you know Queen. <laughs> Queen had to come to the stage and give you all a little, little flavor of Queen. Look, twists and turns as I take my morning carpet and, you know, put my thoughts together. So, yeah, Ears, y'all know Ears. We told Queen what that man said on Ears' microphone. And he know Ears' stage is half a uh, Queen of Ears. So he on my little half a, um, you know, stage. Speaking on my name to my co-host. Hey, mom, boss, how you doing, my darling? It's good to see you teaching your science class. You look so professional. You look so cute that you love, you know, girl, you know, I had to cut up these frogs and cats as a nurse. So, honey, that was the first time. I Wait, mom, boss is a science teacher now? Because mm, I could, cause I, cause I, cause I study biology. I, I, got, I got a chemo ministry. I got a, I got a master's. I got a bachelor. I got a da da da. Wait, is she a, is she a science teacher now? I had a scalpel. I am scared of rats and mm. rat spread eagle. Mm, let me see what she doing over there. What are you over there teaching her? So you're not uh, doing your traveling business? You ain't got your residual income no more? What? Let me see what you're doing over there, mom. I ain't been paying attention to your ugly ass. You go on that damn tray. Hey, but, you know, um, our um, chemistry folks had already pre-cut him down the middle, sliced him down the middle. And with a rat, their body organs um, closely resemble um, Humans, body organs. So you know, we had to go in with the red and find his lungs, his heart, his veins. <laughs> you know, all that stuff. The intestines. Yeah, the queen couldn't be no motherfucking diva then. Okay, I, I drop all that. Lucky to touch it. <laughs> oh Lord, she a science teacher now. Your favorite teacher. All right, this is Walter. Okay, I'm gonna need y'all to. Um, oh Lord, she, oh help our kids. Oh, see, this is why public school. See, this is why our kids are fucked up. Oh Lord, she teaching science. She about to blow up the school. Oh hell no. Your favorite science teacher. Okay, all business. Okay, so what we gonna do? We gonna graph a graph chart. All right, this is uh, ions. This is uh, this is H means uh, hypothermical. Oh, Lord, she's a teacher now. My boss, man, y'all. Okay, y'all follow me on Instagram. Okay, M make sure y'all, you know, if you want to you know the 1999, I'll let all the students pass for 1999. Signed up for my residual income. Oh, Lord, she's a teacher. She'll do grading papers and shit. Oh, Lord. Bless them kids. Bless them kids. I said, when you as a veteran, what did you do when you was in the field? I said, how you doing? <laughs> blessings, blessings. Chosen to be blessed. How you doing? I like your name, and I like your spirit in my chat. And um, seems like I know your spirit from the first place. Exactly, right? I thought you were the 2% of the 1%. I'm a ruby. I'm a ruby diamond. Yeah, I'm not. We got ten thousand billionaires. We got twenty thousand millionaires. We got a hundred thousand billionaires, and I'm in the one percent. Mm -hmm. So, what happened to that one percent of the of the two percent of the three percent? What's your four, five, six million dollar business with the ruby doobie, fresh and fruity tootie? What happened to that shit? Wait, queen still standing. Queen is still standing after all the madness, confusion, the lies. This is what hope, faith look like. Things hopeful, the evidence unseen. Yeah, three years ago, I, I already seen myself standing here, talking to my fans in my right mind, and got everybody else. Okay, on edge. You put me on edge, and Queen is not letting up until food, my money. It's back on my motherfucking plate. Uh oh. She trying to get that food on her plate. TJ, Kwame Brown, you took flu off a motherfucking plate. Okay. So this was a millionaire. It should be. Him and his old ugly T. And you know who you are. Damn, free my nigga TJ. Not the T. He. -he. Until food, my money, 
It's back on my motherfucking plate. Oh. Okay. Here we go. Oh, this was a million, million that did this to me. We got that. And then old ugly chee And you know who you are. And I'm not giving you no clout for your dead, dead, dead channel. Over there, you are so boring. Oh, I ain't trying to tell people uh, where to go. Use a fucking lie. You've been doing it ever since you got here. We got action. And when they, you realize, no, it's your channel nobody wants to go to. You're trying to ease up off that shit. You Damn. are a nothing ass Negro in our sector. And we don't give a fuck who your brother is. If you're not funny on the mic, and you are not now, okay? I don't Damn. like it. You're phony. We all hear it. You laugh. Who you go after is everybody who everybody don't like. So you showing them get along, go along, get along. You can't be able to get along, uh, go along. Because you want to be important. You know, you want to be that one because you had the millionaire brother in jail. You had your little store set up. Don't you fucking play with me. Ooh. Don't you fucking play with me. Ooh. Take your no nothing ass on and sit down somewhere. You're unfunny. Okay. Mm. And I know you got a little problem with that state. I am funny. <laughs> no, you are not funny. Damn. Okay, you have personal gripes. Take your personal gripe ass on some motherfucking way. These are personal issues that are not funny to the masses. You waited three years. We didn't. We were in the trenches for your mama. Okay, so we don't want to hear you. You are a lie, and you're using your mama. Okay, for sympathy. Wow. Wow, really? That's what we're doing, Regina? Boy, this is a goddamn shame. Now she's bringing up... Man, that's... Wow. That's what we're doing. Y'all hear it. I ain't making it up. Wow. As on some motherfucking where these are personal issues that are not funny to the masses. You waited three years. We didn't. We were in the trenches for your mama. Okay? So we don't want to hear you. You are a lie. Bump that ass, bump that ass. You hold bump that ass, bump that ass, bump that ass. Bump that ass. Uh, drive, drive it like it's that. Uh, drive it like it's that. Drive, drive it like it's that. Russell Red. Hey, Super up. shatted five dollars. No young boy, no shafty. I got her now to get her to slob on my dinger like corn on the cob. I can get it for DA low soon as I find them gummies. Head drop. Hold up, Russell. Ah. Damn, shit. All right. Sorry. I had to take a little sniff. All right, let's go back. Appreciate you, Russell. Uh, no young boy, no chef. D, I got her now. She got the slob on the non dinger. I got it as soon as I find them gummies. Oh, shit. Free my nigga, Russell. Let's get it. Let's get it. Uh. There you go, Russ. That's all yours, Playboy. That's all you, Playboy. Cause she talks about these things. <clears throat> I'm, uh, I'm not getting hit. I'm not I was like, well, you no, uh, you're not no dick sucker, cause that man oh. should have uh, plowed, uh, plowed your head into it. 
getting, 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 getting. I was getting some head. You got to get that um gel that's kind of flavored and, you know. It's just that when I drink sometimes, I get a little crazy. It's okay, ain't... take your head out a little bit. Put your tongue down there. This spot over here to the left, that's what I want. See, I don't want you to think I'm a freak or nothing like that. Um, Use your tongue. Oh, uh, Pull your head down to the nuts. Are you okay? Is this it? Is this how you want it? I was getting some head. Getting, getting some head. I usually don't even go home with guys when I first meet them. You don't take in the, the um, penis. You play with it. Well, you make I, love to it. But I just feel so comfortable with you. The whole pole don't go in your mouth, fool. <laughs> and that's how that little piece of the meat in the back of your throat gets fucked up. He's the kind of girl that make your toes fly. What you girl, playing with my, my dick when you sucking with it? That's how me and I. So <laughs> they, they pull your head and oh, they choke you. You are so nasty. They will oh. take their head and pound it down. So it hit that piece of uh, that little piece of meat at the back of the throat. Uh, uh, girl, That's how that little piece of meat get injured. You don't have to put the nut sacks in your mouth. I was getting some head, getting getting some head. I told you I could get a little crazy. They get the uh, rolling eyes in the back. Everything hard. Okay, well, push your head all the way down to the nut sack. We're gonna get the nuts too. All right, motherfucker. Let's get it on. <laughs> You're gonna push them nut sacks down your throat. You're gonna stick them <laughs> nut sacks down your throat till you hit that piece of the meat. I'm a United States Army veteran. Another registered nurse. And you see, you can find me in newspaper clips. It's because Queen ran for political office. I'm the Queen. Me. Okay, okay. I was getting some. Let's get it. Appreciate you, Russell. Fuck. I hate when y'all about to sneeze. Okay, here we go. So yeah, uh, Regina, I don't even know why you're bringing that up. That, that's that's real fucked up that you even saying that. But y'all hear it, right? I don't know why you're bringing this man's mother up and saying that he's using his mother for what sympathy. She's saying that Regi that Regina is saying that TJ and KB using their mother for sympathy. Wow. Shush. No, you are not funny. Okay, you have personal gripes. Take your personal gripe ass on some motherfucking way. These are personal issues that are not funny to the masses. You waited three years. We didn't. We were in the trenches for your mama. Okay, so we don't want to hear you. You are a lie, and you're using your mama. Okay, for sympathy to change the subject on a fucking stage. You're three years too late. Okay. Wow. Yeah, she actually said that. Yep, she actually said it. <sighs> no editing, no chopped up. All right, y'all be like, D chopping up, D chopping up. No, I don't chop up shit. Mama, okay? I don't chop for up For sympathy. Shit. We were in the trenches for your mama, okay? So we don't want to hear you. You are a lie and you're using your mama, okay? For sympathy. That's fucked up. To change the subject on a fucking stage. You're three years too late, okay? Wow. Go back on your stage and go over there and cry and lie like you did on my stage, okay? Wow. And that's why I'm gonna put your ass in the dirt for coming to my motherfucking house and laughing in my motherfucking face while stealing off my motherfucking plate. You? Yo, this. <laughs> Boy, I, I don't wanna say what I wanna say, but man. She, you. Whoo. Boy, this lady right here, boy. Shh. You're not a good person, Regina. You're really not. A, you're you're not a good person at heart. And um, it's gonna be a special place for you. It's gonna be a special place for you. You, M.A. M.A. Brown. You're done. You're done. Your kind, you come from slavery days, backstabbing slavery days, when folks had the freedom and was on the way out. You help catch them. You help catch them. I see your spirit. You hate them. 
from slave days. Me a boy, <laughs> me a boy, my new Joe Matrix. Me a boy, oh, they talk about my mom three years ago. We don't want to hear it. Get your unfunny ass somewhere and go cry and lie. You lying about uh, a rocked over shoes. Now your brother said he didn't have no shoes. So his story, okay, he don't told his story, no shoes. You might as well not have on no motherfucking shoes right now at your fucking age, and this man was a millionaire. Those turned over shoes are not no work shoes, broke ass. You are broke. You on here begging for cash apps. <clears throat> and them shoes, okay? Damn by some. Cause they was, you know, your toes in them shoes didn't go all the way to the front. Now I'm gonna have to agree with 504 on that one. That's all. You had a bust loose little pinky toe out of one side of the shoe. You was gnarled up in the shoe. The rest of your, you know, toes. Them shoes about 10 years old, okay? The boy told the no shoe lie. And the cheese line, lie, okay? Now at 40 some years old, it looked like your story about not having shoes may be true. Okay, zoo animal. <laughs> you need some shoes. Uh, free my nigga TJ. Free my nigga KB. Woo! Yep, now she's making fun of slavery, slaves, and people's... Mm-mm-mm. Regina, Regina, Regina. You know, she was at your drive. You had access to, nigga. Don't you motherfucking play with me. Okay? Don't you motherfucking play with me. Now he's a zoo animal. Know, there was a lot of them big size shoes there, but not many Andre the Giants there. Okay, don't you fucking play with me. You didn't. You wasn't there to work. I was there stacking shoes. Okay, and you gonna bring your ass, T ass, talking about uh, we y'all, we need a little time. We had we the leech. You calling somebody a leech? You, you. <laughs> I smoke with Mike Tyson. You got all these stories to tell about all the celebrities you met because of your little big bruh. Okay, bruh. You are nothing, nothing, nothing ass, unfunny ass, ugly ass, uncool ass, Negro. Okay? Yeah. Put that in your motherfucking pipe and smoke it, nigga. Because you, you don't be a bonus to queen. Because you're the ringleader. Misled these folks on some prison shit thoughts. You're a kook, okay? You're a prison kook. Look at how it turned out for you. All those guys now, they already was no good reputation soiled. That's why they wouldn't come on camera. If we would have seen eight tenths of these people on camera, Day one, there ain't gonna be no long talk with no motherfucking channel. I don't wanna see no creep with a mask on. No, 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 no. Mm -mm. With a mask on? I wanna see somebody that look a little bit sane. Okay, you ain't got to be my heart, but you gonna come over here. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Mm -mm. Candy man. I'm talking about with a mask on. I'm talking about double? I'm talking about double, double? Damn, free my nigga double. Ah, oh, damn. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. Ooh, hey. my nigga double brain. You won't be a bonus. Cause you said on my motherfucking stage. Shh. I smiled in my face. You gonna be a bonus? Oh, I still fool off my motherfucking plate. You the only one got close enough to do it and bold enough to do it. You you push your brother into doing it. Mm -hmm. And I'm not excluding him and his dumb, 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 all his motherfucking life decisions. Okay. I'm not babysitting no grown motherfucking man. I ain't Mr. Lopez. Honey, I got me a Draco at home. If you can't stop cussing these folks out and getting flags, you on your motherfucking own, okay? This ain't no, I'm gonna be reckless and uh, violate community guidelines and then, hey, oh, I'm gonna let her just write something up. No, bullying and harassment, I can't even get myself out of those shits. Cause you know what? At those moments, while I'm triggered, it can be perceived. as bullying and harassment. I ain't my mind, I know what the fuck I'm doing, all right? Leave me alone, leave me alone, leave me alone, okay? Big mama, big mama. Stop hear that throat bottom. And my voice is waking up. It's waking up. It's waking up. And it's good to wake up with your mind intact. You can still see here with your glasses. I can see clearly. I can see clear. I can smell. Skin glowing. Hair. Mm -hmm. Hair what? what? That's what you're looking at at 58. Wait, wait. Skin glowing hair what? Wait, wait, wait. We got to run that back. Smell skin glowing, glowing. hair, hair, what mm -hmm. healthy, wealthy, and wise. That's yeah. what you're looking at at 58. Hair, what because I know how to make no, I, I want you to describe your hair. You said your skin glowing, your nose is knowing, and your eyes are iron. Nose, 
You can smell. Eyes, you can see. Skin glowing. Hair is there. My hair is there. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, your hair is there. Yeah, yeah. It's, it's there. Feel whole important because they are important. All of us have something to bring to the table without worrying if a tee hee hee type Negro is around plotting and planning. You all are going to have to scan your rooms, scan your pounds for this type of energy. Y'all getting up there because he's the cousin of the brother of and that boy is bringing all that poison energy to your channels. Because I ain't going to stop talking about what happened to him when he was 11 years old. He told his story to Tommy. And knowing that story and coming to this platform from Mother's Day of 2022, and still doing it because, I mean, they still talk about uh, this violent talk of doing sex. I mean, they made love making. I'm not at home. Mm -mm. It's a real thing, baby. But they make sex yuck. And it must be yuck with them when it stops working, right? Well, it's itty bitty. You're goddamn right. That's where I'm going to. Because I'm going to level this playing field. Period. You have no business even speaking to women and arguing with women. And you think I'm not going to mention what your real issue is. That's dead, dead, dead. Okay? Because if it ain't dead, what the fuck is you on YouTube for? I know that one now. Okay? Y'all see Cap loading mail. He don't hear no more. He got that little girlfriend and they don't got back, you know, that big up. Y'all don't see Cap loading on this motherfucker. That man is alive, thriving. And well, you know, y'all know how he be talking. So, y'all know these men that stay on here for hours. <laughs> All of that is dead. dead too, <laughs> along with them dead jokes. Wow. Okay? And this is from the young ones, too. Puberty voice. Your voice ain't even right. You didn't even, you know, grow out down there. Oh, damn. Okay? You heard the form down there. I get it. Who, Rodney? You be digging and pulling it, such and it ain't there. Puberty voice. Oh. <laughs> damn, free my nigga Rodney. Oh shit, we got Kwame Andre Brown doubling the Brown in the building. Oh shit. KB, 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 listen, listen. Andre W, super shattered $100. You asked, you'll get it. Peace D, good night uh, all, look, 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 smiley look. face. KB, I told you to sign in your other name because they don't know your other troll name. So you got to donate from the other troll name because this one already been blown. In my last stream, I, I, I kind of snitched on you. Yeah, yeah, Kwame Brown, Andre Dub. Yeah, so so you got to donate from your other one. But, but I ain't going to tell, tell them, them who you is because, you know, she kind of, you know, picked up on it last time and she said that Kwame Brown... That damn D, that 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 Kwame Brown, damn D paid, you know, all that shit. So that name is blown. So so you gotta use the other one. All right. Salute to Andre in the motherfucking building. Goddamn Andre. Andre! Turn me up! Appreciate you, Andre, with that hundred, hundred, hundred dollar donation. Ooh. What's that? Uh-huh. Ooh, mm -hmm. ooh, that a hundred? Ooh, Andre in the building, man, showing up and showing out. I just want to fucking get it. You hear me? Ooh, ooh, huh? What's that right there? Oh, honey. Oh, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, ooh. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you made him mad with that. You know, big, big, bigger, 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 bigger back man. Mm -hmm. Thank you for that hundred. Put that on the docket, huh? Appreciate you, Andre, aka Kwame Brown, aka number one draft pick, aka hell of a nigga. Appreciate you, Andre, for that hundred dollar donation. Yes, sir. <laughs> you didn't. You weren't born with two. You weren't born with nothing. Get in there, puberty boys. <laughs> down there. Okay, you were deformed down there. I get it. You be digging and pulling and searching. It ain't there, puberty boys. It ain't there. Puberty boys. Get in there. Puberty boys. Get in there. Puberty boys. Get in there. Puberty boys. 
down there. Okay, you heard the form down there. I don't get it. You be digging and pulling and searching. It ain't there. Pewdie boys. That's actually crazy. That shit sounds crazy. protrusion you just a close up skin down there puberty voice damn free my nigga do, do you have a piss bag damn now you piss puberty voice if you don't have a wee wee you don't have a vajaja you, it's closed you just have flesh there damn okay? so they don't you know probably had to rewire your plumbing into a bag to piss puberty damn. voice stand up on camera let's see what you got what you working with i ain't talking about with your piss bag because you have nothing else but flesh down there coverage okay you weren't born with shit oh, you weren't born with two you weren't even born with one nothing nothing, nothing 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 Voice. The voice will give it away. Damn. The voice will give it away. The list. The shifting teeth. Okay. The teeth. Yes, it is like dead, dead, dead. I don't give a fuck what y'all say. I've been living a long time. Okay. <laughs> Puberty voice. You ain't born with nothing. Okay. You don't even know what the thrill is. You just heard about the thrill. Nigga. Nigga. Nigrette. <laughs> Brunelda, okay? I'm back on you. Now, Slim. Oh, uh, Brunelda. I know y'all working with this young man. Uh, this is sniper, y'all see great Read my nigga Brunelda. And I ain't gonna bring him. Oh, uh, shit, Brunelda. But I am gonna maintain my position. Oh, shit. The young man ain't right, and he ain't gonna never be right as Free long as nigga. he goes after his elders. And I don't give a fuck what we did. That's what old. Uh, exactly. See. These these jokes are dumb as hell because she she says everybody got a lisp, everybody got the same thing. Just like everybody's gay, everybody got a little wee wee. Like man, y'all gotta come with some new jokes. Everybody t fucked up. Come on, man. You stop with these general great value jokes. These old great value jokes. These old. Sam's Club packages, like it's the same shit, man. Like, <laughs> y'all need some ghost writers, man. All right, somebody please help these people with some new jokes. Uh, uh jump in the ocean, hat got mad. Ignore us. We're not changing for you. I know I'm not. Yeah, we gave y'all the secret to the success, but no, you can't ignore it. You can't even stop looking at us. You're addicted to the mother like an old Simon Shelter. Y'all ain't never seen nothing like this. Exactly, Chucky. What's and up, all we're doing is telling our stories. Lou, Lou, Baby, what's entertaining up, stories. Lou, when you live long, you live. See you, Bitcoin. Right. I see y'all in the chat. Trina, what's up, Trina? What are we doing? Talk about here. When you're talking on your life, you ain't got to lie on your life. Okay? Do I remember everything? No. Do I, you know, soup up my story? Yes. But okay. when I say soup up, I ain't saying lying. Lying. I'm just saying charismatically, I go into a place and tell my story. Tell lying. my story. Tell my story. lying. You be lying. Okay? So that's all I do. Brunilda, 504 did nothing to you. Okay? Damn, Bermilda. You're trying to come up. But I'm just telling you. That's just the wrong way. Damn, free That's not nigga. content. Oh, Who are you? Shit. What are your dreams and aspirations? Damn. Why do you talk about these uh, characters? I don't know these characters. Tell us your fascination with these. Um, they look like gothic. I believe gothic characters. Tell us. That is not doxing you, telling us why. How did you get uh, disability at your age? Is it them too? Damn. Because um, why are you not outside more than all being physical? Are you on lithium? Are you on a straight jacket? Are you on okay. that shit too? You look crazy over there. Same script, different uh -oh. games. You a little Larry Jane on that shit too. She playing with her nose. Same script, different cast. Mm, You're not nose, exciting huh? to speak about. Are you on lithium? Are you on Hey, 504. Are you gonna make a video on this? Uh-huh. Look at that. Mm-hmm. Look at that. 504. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Because uh -oh. why are you not outside at morning? No, it's being uh -oh. physical. Look at this. I think she got some white powder on her nose. 
Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Got him. Are you yeah. missing? Mm -hmm. And she's sniffing. Are you in a straight jacket? Uh oh. The five up four. We got a new video for you. Yeah. Okay. Got him. You look crazy over there. Fucking with a nose. Same script, different cast. You're not exciting to speak about, okay? Your disrespect of elderly black women, I don't know which one it is. Got him. Hit it, quit it, and move the fuck on. Don't that? Pump it, dump it. You don't know nothing about that, okay? And then try to talk righteous and religion. You're another one with the God shit, okay? Mm -hmm. We don't want to hear it. Because in that book, you are misquoting. It speaks to how you're supposed to treat your elders. You ain't right, okay? So you, everybody want to think, oh, it's got to be a big, bad crime, a killing, a shooting, uh, something. No, disrespecting your elder will get you the results. Why are you sitting there hauling your twins, okay? Auntie Sasha, talking about black women, elderly black women. We don't know you and we don't care what you say. It's not going to change anything. It's only making you look creepier and creepier and creepier and suspect, suspect. I don't know what you are. I don't. Hey. Okay. And if y'all don't stop the boy, the women don't say it about certain men. Y'all seen how we got uh, Gay Rick out of here. Uh -huh. We want to get Brunel out of here. He's creepy. Damn. Free my nigga 86. Oh, she, she said we got him out of here. Oh, damn. So, Regina, you, you the one that flagged Garrick? We? Who is we, Regina? Did you mass flag, Garrett? You said we got him out of here. Damn, Garrett. Look like we got a confession. Look like we got a confession. Boy, the women don't say it about certain men. Y'all seen how we got uh, Gay Rick out of here? We will get Brunel out of here. He's creepy. We. Why can't he talk about video games, sports? Something else. These gothic characters. Him. Why is he online? This young. I, I my young person is online. I was working. I'm 58 years old. I'm just not making it to the internet, okay? Ain't no fucking way I could be in my 20s. I'm out grinding. This boy, you know, these people cannot make it in society, okay? So they come online and villainize folks because we're bubbly all over the place, okay? Everybody want me on their stage. The motherfucking on the show, girl. It's on the floor. Brunelda? Playing with your nose. I'm going to give you two more weeks to get it out your system, okay? We don't know you. You was introduced to the stage by the bishop, okay? Your introduction, mm -mm. I can't, mm -mm. I don't know what it is. And it sitting around, creating pictures of women and all this stuff, you're not funny either, okay? You say the same thing over and over. Only Rainey can tell the story. Only the people involved in a situation can tell the story, not a bystander. That's clearly biased because you know what? What's wrong with people like you? Two weeks ago, 504 was your number one girl. Hey, free my nigga. She was your number one girl. Until you got a buzz, your name started being called. Damn, D is outsourcing his fuck shit to you and others. Damn, free me. And their channels went down, Brunelda. Your channel's not gonna grow. It's gonna peak. It's not gonna grow. And if you think getting $5, some lunch money is going, you know, and this is your time to shine, come, you're boring. Damn. You breathe, you sigh, you ain't stop that. Damn. At your own show, you're bored at your own show. Okay? Why is she going in on Bermuda so like you that? Can become entertaining. Talking about you. Damn. A celebrity news. But bashing a black woman, your channel, that's not to grow your channel. And then you're going to be just like the guy that jumped in the ocean. But dear life, instead of holding on to a floaty, he was holding to a hat. Okay. Hey, me. When I get through sending him. Mm. You. You must have just got out of the ocean too, huh? Yeah, I, I can tell that you don't wear hats in the ocean. Mm -hmm. You just got straight out the ocean, just natural, beautiful. You right, you right, you right. In his own words, clipped up, and like I can't say in two and three hours of noise, bells and whistles. I got it out, time stamped out. Ooh. Let me see the top of your head again. And uh, I'm gonna circle back to the women's shelters that he included in his skits without their permission. And, uh, okay. When I get through sending him, he needs some words clipped up and I can't send two and three hours of noise, bells and whistles. I got it out. Yeah. To all the 
principal superintendents and uh, I'm going to circle back to the women's shelters that he included in his kids without their permission. And I'm going to show his words leading up during and after. He left that women's shelter. And I want to introduce Queen Regina. No, I want to I'm say something. And then you're going to be just like the guy that jumped in the ocean. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. This is it. For dear life, instead of holding on to a floaty, he was holding to a head. Okay? Mm -hmm. When I get through sending him his own words clipped up, and I can't send two and three hours of noise, bells and whistles. That was right there. I got it out. Time stamp. There we go. There. Hmm. I love your hair. Looks uh nice. What is this? Is that a bird? Was that like a feather? What is what is that right there in my chocolate chip? What is it? Chat, do y'all know what this part right here is? Ladies, what do you call this right here? Not too sure. I'm just, I just want to ask because I want to get my mom one of these for her birthday. Her birthday is coming up, so I, I, I know she like you know head head things. So Regina, make sure that you add this on your uh, Amazon list. Yeah, because I want to get my mom one of those. It's a, a headband. Oh, okay. Nice, nice, nice. What's good on you? Let's read. Now, to all the principals, superintendents, and uh, I'm going to circle back to the women's shelters that he included in his skits without their permission. And I'm going to show his words leading up, during, and after. He left that women's shelter, and I'm going to introduce Queen Regina to the young lady, Miss Charlie. See, what's like, call me, stop me. I never, that never sat right in my spirit. Why are you calling me and not talking to him? Why are you calling me? Don't do this. Don't call the shelter. Why? This is my business. Why are you in my business? See, all of this could have stopped the day he went to the shelter if he had not made that phone call and me, begging me not to call the shelter. Why? Why would you beg me to stop and not to say anything to this man? And then later on, you bring him up to tell me to suck his dick? I can't deal with that, young man. So this is not personal. It's business. I'm looking at some of your decision making. When you came after the queen, you got to learn a lesson that will always trigger a muscle memory. Oh, how painful. This time close for you. How you wish that you just would go away get up with it. This was a bad decision. And I hope somebody gave up the person who came up with it. Whoa, whoa, wait, 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 what? How you wish that just go away get up. This was a bad decision. This was a bad decision. What's that right there? Oh, honey? Oh! Ooh, ah, ah, ooh. Mm -hmm. yeah, you made a mess. My um, I got a friend that wants to know what kind of uh grease you use for your for your scalp. Yeah, uh, can you can you make sure you put your uh hair grease that you use because I, I like the way that you kind of 
make your hair look like a, a tornado. Yeah, they they want to know what what kind of hair product do you do? Because this like look like the eye of a hurricane. Uh, and Halloween is coming up, so they want to know how did you um you know turn your hair into a, a tennis ball? Yeah, so so make sure that you leave the link in your Amazon because th that'd be a great Halloween costume. Mm hmm. Sure would. Yeah, because I want to figure out how did you get that swivel dibble right there? And how did you get that hole right there? That's pretty impressive. Is this your early co Halloween costume? I like it. It's cute. Yeah, I, I like the way that you strip cotton balls and, and you glued it to your head. It looks, yeah, I, I, I might definitely take that idea. Yeah, I like that. That's 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 very nice, right? Oh, yeah, there we go. We got a good, yeah, this is good. Yeah, I'm, I'm a, I like that. That, that looks nice. Mm -hmm. And I hope somebody get up the person who came up with this pathetic plan. All you had to do was hire me privately. Oh, you had to my normal. Oh, you had to. Oh, it's it's a it's a plan. Oh, okay. So you're trying to figure out who was the mastermind behind your firing. Okay. Oh, okay. Okay. Yeah, hurricane, tornado, all that shit. Mass flood, snow flood. It looked like a blizzard. The person who came up with this pathetic plan. All you had to do was hire me privately. That's what normal business me. When you came after Queen, you got to learn a lesson that will always trigger a muscle memory. Oh, how painful. This time was for you. How you wish you just would go away and get up from it. This was a bad decision. And I hope somebody gave up the person who came up with this pathetic plan. All you had to do was hire me privately. That's what normal businessmen do. That's what normal businessmen do. Your brother has already confessed. Tarek has already confessed. And for him, Having that plan and coming to my stage, he's gonna have to feel that pain. <clears throat> that memory of fucking with big mama. When she did all she can do for his mama. Thank me when he's on the stage and all that fake cheering up. This man here, y'all. Mm -mm. He want to be somebody in life other than standing in the shadows. You're not in the shadows anymore. You're not even in the shadows on here. You're standing on your own talent. You're not talented on the mic. You are going to have to create a skill. Practice in the mirror, talking. You know you sound angry, bitter, frightening to the women of our sector. There's places for you to sound like a great bait. Wow. She's an animal. Free, this ain't it. Free my nigga, TJ. All that cursing you're doing to women? Mm -hmm. Because guess what? I'm going to clip you up too and put you side by side. Your brother, since he's so concerned about his brand, Damn. you're the worst thing ever to his brand. When he was in the NBA, you fucked up his brand. Damn. You came to YouTube and helped fuck up his brand. Damn, TJ. You're not a smart guy. You need attention. You need to feel validated. You need to feel, I'm not just an inmate, you all. I live pal. I'm a supervisor. You sound stupid. Damn. You shouldn't even be nowhere working. What happened to the investing in businesses? You up here bragging about having a job, working for the man, a supervisor. You're not no supervisor. And when you tell these stories, I feel sorry for you. I'm a supervisor. I don't, I don't go in the field. I don't work in the field. You know I want to. Nobody wants to work and do labor work. Stop it. You're in your 40s. You've been a mule all your life. Even in prison, they use your back and your ass. Damn. Hey, don't you fucking play with me? She said you've been a mule your whole life. You're no supervisor. And at 45, what kind of accolade is that to be proud of coming to the stage and speaking on the black excellence like me, the politician, the registered nurse, the criminal justice major, the army veteran, the businesswoman? On my own motherfucking business. I ain't no here bragging about working for the white man. I'm a supervisor now. You yeah. Daisy? I'm a supervisor now. We talked over shoes now, I'm a Daisy. Damn. I'm a supervisor. Damn. You sick. And you'll never, you'll never be equally yoked with a woman of substance. <laughs> Not you. Mm. You secretly hate yourself and others. What? It's sad to 
hear you brag about being a supervisor. It's eight people. It's eight people. I supervise them. You know, come to work on time. You know, my morals, my morals are standards. Damn. Nigga, please. Who are you talking to? Damn. You better talk to Kooks. You need them to believe your lies about yourself. PJ. Supervisor. You got young men hearing you say that. You sound like a slave catcher. Damn. I got all these people working under me. I need supervisor. If I can get up and be on time, so can you. Don't let me get that pen. Nigga, you can't even talk. So I know you're there to be a crowd hater. You can't talk. You can't write the sentences. Hey, TJ. And at 47 years old, coming on camera, saying you supervise eight people at a piano shop in the 40s, and your brother was, is, I don't know what he is, financially. You wasted a lot of money. And now you're old and you're dead down there. Okay? You thought this day would never come? Hmm? You ain't prepared to have a dead dick on you with no money broke. Oh, he's bald. <laughs> I'm, I'm skinny, y'all. We don't care. I know I don't. The words coming out of your mouth and the way you sound like a motherfucking hillbilly, okay? You're not impressive. You're not impressive at all. Okay? Okay? Ooh, my gloves are off with you. Hark. You came up with a scheme against the woman that stood for your mama. Went against your own blood relative, talking about, uh, you gonna have to come back to town. You stupid. You should have left that town a long time ago. But see, you want to be important. That's why you stay in a small town. You're still in important. Everybody laughing at y'all. Look at them boys. How they blew that money. Look at that man's shoe. All that money. Hey, his brother had to look at that shoes. Nigga, yeah, they laughing at you. And let me tell you something, new teeth. When you jump your ass in that ocean, holding on to a hat with their life. Damn. Do you think people was laughing with you or at you? Ask yourself the question. You knew it wasn't a laughing matter. If that hat slipped off in the water. You knew it wasn't a laughing matter. To hold on to a hat that tight in the ocean and you could have drowned. Come back to hands, all right? You could have swallowed some water wrong or a little current up underneath the water could have hit you wrong. You worried about your hairline. No hairline. All right, I'm, I'm going to make sure that I try to get one like yours. Yeah, I, I need, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm going to go to the doctor and get me a, a hair transplant and I'm going to show him your picture. I want mine just like yours. Yep, because that right there, fresh. Ooh, look at that. I'm going to be fresh as hell when the fans watch it. Yeah. Yeah, I wish my hairline was as nice as yours. Mm. Damn. Free me. Free my hairline. Because my hairline is not as nice as Regina's. And free me. Free me. We were laughing. But Queen cried a little. A tear drop. It's sad. The ugly duckling knows he's still ugly. Unfortunately. The guy that poisoned himself with alcohol that could not even stop himself, even when he knew his stomach was upset, he was gagging, probably started vomiting. He kept drinking. Well, are you sure that feeling? You can't stop eating. I can't stop drinking. What's up, Russell? She got that rare money hairline. <laughs> nah, man. That shit crispy, man. What you talking about, man? She got that Steve Harvey. You know what I mean? She got that Don King. You know I mean, that's crispy right there, man. Appreciate you, Russell, with that $2. Look, 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 Regina. I got an alcohol problem. You got an eating problem. So we both got problems. I drink a lot. You eat a lot. All right? Hey, man. You know? It's okay. It's okay. I can fix my problem and you can fix your problem too. Alcohol. Past the vomiting. Past the cloudy brain delirium. He kept drinking. Nothing that says I love you. I'll stop him. Don't do my body like this. And he wants to claim he's a weight trainer. Weight trainers don't poison themselves with alcohol. Uh -oh, this is a self playing with your nose. that uses alcohol with to your nose again. equal cutting himself. Okay? I'm telling you all these weird people who don't want to be online doing what they really want to wait, do. Wait, wait. Now I cut myself? <laughs> now I cut myself too? Stop him. Don't do my body like this. And he wants to claim he's a weight trainer. Weight trainers don't poison themselves with alcohol. This is a self-hater that uses alcohol to equal cutting himself. Okay? I'm telling you all these weird people who don't want to be online doing what they really want to do so they drink. Which is equally deadly. 
I mean, what, what do you think you, do? you are cutting? This is cutting the drinking to a, a, a delirium stupor, drinking to your place in the ICU, and then drinking to after they leave the ICU. We need to one pick of you. This ain't normal for a person that is normal and sane. Because once you start gagging and throwing up and drinking too much, that's your body trying to get you to stop. Hurting yourself. Cut, that's cut, weird. Drinking, cutting. And I, different. and I cut myself? If you make it to poisoning your own self with alcohol, you was trying to unalive yourself in my opinion. This is you too, I'm teaching. If you have drinkers out here who are blacking out, because you drink to black out, you can't even remember your day. Your drinking is so bad. And you don't have classy women you are dating because women are like sloppy drunks. You smell the vomit, the puke, yeah. the piss, the shit. It's unfortunate. Oh, you think you didn't shit on yourself? The, 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 day, the night you poisoned yourself? I know you shitted on yourself because of the abdominal muscles that rescued you that night. You threw up so hard you peed and shit on yourself. Mm-hmm. After You're I not cut well myself. When you can drink yourself to hurt yourself that way. And not well. And this is serious because this is not for a joke. When I heard you tell the story about poisoning yourself with alcohol and you still drink up the poisonous cup. Today, you know what poisoned you? You have that memory. And you still drink up a poisonous cup. You don't like yourself. You don't want to be here. I wish I had a drink Seek right now. treatment for alcoholism. Seek treatment. This is not yes. a normal, healthy life at 40. Yes. When you, oh my God, when you're outside of your stage and you attempt to try to it goes horribly wrong. You don't know what to say. You're antisocial. You're a person that tried to unlive yourself with alcohol, and I don't give a fuck what you say because there's no way myself. you can keep drinking past vomiting, Ooh. and you keep drinking to your in ICU and 5150. That is not a good sign, and it's not a good sign that you're still drinking out that poison. See, I tried to kill myself, I cut myself, and what else I do? Uh, poison myself. Okay. What is about that cup of alcohol? They're not laughing with you. You're not well. You are not well. When I leave the floor, Queen, and you say I can have a serious subject and still be entertaining, but this is serious. For all my folks who uh, drink socially, just know, and I'm sure you all are responsible drinkers. You don't drive, that's what he does. Free me. You don't go to uh, a uh, drive through. That's what he does. Instead of Ubering. You're, you're male, door dashing. He rather plays Russian roulette, not just with his life, with others. He's drunk. Drunk on the mind. That's what I. Mm-hmm. You know you have a problem with alcohol. You know you was hospitalized. No one put anything in your drink. You gave yourself drink after drink after drink after drink, even when your body was vomiting. Stop. Your signal, your safety mechanism. And you continue to drink past right, your safety no. mechanism. Tell that story. Enough. That's mental. Enough, Virginia. Alcoholism. You're covering, you're messing up something. Yes. But we see it. Yes. You're 40 now. Mm-hmm. I think you was in your, you was a teenager in your 20s when you poisoned yourself. Yes. That's, That's a long time. Yes. To just be floating in the world. Mm-hmm. You know you're different. I don't want to float no more. You uh, burnt your brain cells with that alcohol. When you poisoned yourself, mm-hmm. you're just a shell of a man. Oh. That's why you still drink other poisonous cup. Yeah. When you can let the poisonous cup go, you'll find yourself. I'm, I'm, I'm letting it go today. When you let the cup poison go, I'm you'll find go yourself today. the alcohol. It's your crypt tonight. Yes. Mutilator. You're a self mutilator. Oh. In my opinion, my professional opinion, anyone who can drink themselves, pass vomiting, and still manage to poison their own self, to put something in his own drink, and commence to just drink, 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 drink. Pass the abdominal muscles. The abdominal muscles are just as strong as the glutes, aren't they? You know about muscles. The abdominal muscle yeah. saved your life. It's kind of made you throw up all that shit. You try to drink some more, but your abdominal muscles went into overdrive to save you. But see, the tricky thing about the abdominal muscle and causing you to vomit yeah. is you could be lying down. I could have vomit. You drowned. I could have died. Oh, wow. Damn. You'll vomit. Can I yield the blow? Put that cup down. Okay. New teeth is not going to do it for you. No, no. The problem is the poisonous cup.